all welcome back to our channel so students uh, in this video i will tell you certain things which it will be helpful to score o grade that is how you need to score o grade in operations research subject and as some of the students will have that uh, uh, curiosity to score o grade and my answer is it is damn easy to score o grade in operations research after completing your preparation this video will be helpful only for the students who have completed all five units whatever i have said in my videos and after completing that just watch this video this tips will be helpful in your final examination to score o grade because what are the things i have followed when i was attempting this paper in my mba that time i have scored o grade so that's why i will tell you certain thing how you need to score o grade okay so how to score o grade after completing your five units preparation theory problematic everything the first thing you need to remember it ma attempting all questions in the examination is important part a five questions part b five questions and case study this three things if you are attempting only then only expect for part uh, then only expect for o grade if you are attempting only uh, four questions in long if you are attempting only three questions in short you have no time time management is not uh, there that time you will definitely not score o grade full paper first and the important tip is attempting full paper without attempting full paper you can't explain you can't expect o grade okay this is the first thing second thing ma first attempt part b then attempt part a then go with the part c this is the order in this order you attempt it okay or else you can attempt part a part b and part c also if you are perfect and if you know the time management because part b is important more because 40 marks will be carried in that section only so that's why you need to give more preference to part b okay then you can go with part a and part c part a you need to complete in half an hour part c also you need to complete in half an hour remaining one and a half hour you need to allot it for part b part b one and a half hour maximum minimum you it should get there okay time is should get there third one is ma when you are attempting problematic when you are attempting problematic if in middle of the sum you have forgot the steps some of the students what they will do means here something you need to write it but you don't know what you need to write it you forgot it some of the students uh, what you will do means they will strike off like this instead of doing that strike off whatever you know whatever the values you are thinking that it should be just keep something or the other but your handwriting your structure of your answer should get impressive without any strike offs so that sometimes sometimes this is the important thing sometimes indivisilator may not see that answer is wrong that time you can able to score eight on eight marks in your long so that's why when you don't know the problematic structure also best structure is important in middle of the structure you don't know something that time also just just write whatever you understand whatever you remember it so that is also plays an important role okay so without striking offs without uh, any mistakes if you are presenting your problematic answer in a correct way in a structured way with a good hand understandable handwriting this will be also useful for you to get o grade in your final examination first thing in your mind should get that you need to impress your evaluator you are the digital correction use black pen only carry your calculators also and uh, i have done a separate video for the case study that separate video for the case study is also very much important case study itself adds a 10 marks weightage in your examination and the last tip is in the last side of your booklet last page of your booklet just keep rough rough work you should not do any in your question paper anything on the pad or the bench just all the calculation everything any things if you want to do the calculation just put it on the 
back side and the last page of your booklet then the evaluator see that they, he will get that he or she will get that impressed that students has done some calculations also okay and this is the last tip and optional tip if you are having time attempt at least one extra question attempt just give an attempt okay don't write full answer also just give an attempt and the last tip is uh, which i have followed personally complete your booklet mark i know that uh, students may get shocked that how can we complete that many papers but it possible for the students who have speed handwriting if it is optional if it is not compulsory optional uh, complete try to complete your booklet try to fill the answers for eight marks three sides your answers is must and should so just this tips if you are following easy tips if you are following means definitely you can score for grade in your over subject i hope that this video will be useful if you have any further doubts let me know in the comment section all the best for your examination as well as your preparation see you all in the next video bye bye